The Dutt jet is an improvement on the old T or crook shaped jetting ones. It's made hand jetting much easier. The Dutt jet has a metal shroud with a small lip across the leading edge over a T bar with three flush nozzles. It's a good idea to fit a pressure gauge at the handpiece. This will tell you if the equipment is operating at the recommended pressure of around 600 kilopascals or 100 psi at the handpiece whilst it's operating for adult sheep. Hand jetting is the most thorough method of applying insecticide to prevent fly strike, but only if it's done properly. To jet properly, you should stand in the race with the sheep, so personal protective equipment is needed. Waterproof trousers, elbow length PVC gloves and gumboots are adequate. A single pass of the Dutch jet from pole to the base of the tail is sufficient to protect sheep from body strike. The speed of the pass should be such that jetting fluid pools at the trailing edge of the shroud but does not overflow over the surface of the wool and run off. The emphasis is on thoroughness, not speed. New South Wales Agriculture recommends you should aim to apply half a litre of fluid per month of wool. The sheep's head should be pushed forward to open the back of the neck. Jetting like this will deliver about half a litre of fluid per month of wool growth. A blow of the duck jet from each hock up over the tail will protect sheep from crutch strike. When dragged along the sheep's back, the lip opens the wool staple to direct the jetting fluid onto the skin. You can see that the fluid is held in the fleece wool. It will slowly percolate around the sheep over the skin. After a few minutes, the fluid can be seen dripping from the belly.